As we look at the round of 16, heat number seven, John John Florence taking on Callum Robson and sort of on a day of upsets. I'm glued to this one, you guys, for all that Cal Callum's done in this event, especially in the barrel, especially against big names. What are you expecting from Caltex? Anytime that you know I had a chance to roll and I went, it ended up paying off and and yeah, that's all you can do. <laughs> that was one of the goals coming into this year. Was using priority a little different than your rookie year, huh? Yeah, I yeah, definitely, definitely had to work a little bit on that priority. From way deep, John going left. Here he goes, pulls up and under. Standard procedure for the man on his home break. Tough exit as well but he knows how to change positions on demand. Way less intensity than Crosby wave, but just way deeper and way longer, a better wave overall. And John here on his backhand, somehow finding the left, um, going against the grain. Now we've got more waves on the way. John John Florence loving his home break, driving through a beautiful section of back door, and he gets the exit again. This is the rhythm that you're scared of if you're competing against John. I always feel like this format is so brilliant for John. I love the way he's shifting around the lineup and just searching and finding these waves. This was way further in, but he just knew it was going to run along the reef. Such a small exit there. Both of his waves that he's had in the last five minutes have just been so you know, difficult to read, but he just weaves and can get so deep and ride these things so impeccable. Yeah, it's interesting when you hear someone say, oh, John's a great tube rider. He will exit out. As we catch up with John John Florence, waves already spinning multiple times. And believe us, we are still watching <laughs> that whitewater foam ball just in case. Such a beautiful place to be, the North Shore of Oahu. And how about that up and under to kick things off at the start of this wave. Big blast off the top, setting up a nice carve and tail release and going down. Callum Robson looking to get involved. Manny McGilvray is just his highlights over the years. We'll get back to that John taking off. John John Florence still gone. There he is once again, making it look so easy. Um, not that big of a gap in between them, though. Like, it's still so enriched, mostly for Callum. He's so good at finding those nine-point rides, and looks like he's letting John go on this one. Let's see what's going to happen. No priority. Big drive through the first section. Florence still looking for an exit and goes down uh oh we see someone up the right and then pulling up and under callum robson looking for a little bit more space and it shuts down on him but callum definitely provided some highlights for us the, the nine that we kicked off the event with that was a pipeline and then some glorious barrels earlier today into the nines again so callum's reputation of being a total tube hound is cemented as he will be focusing on Sunset Beach and John will be in another quarterfinal.